about default ketones. Oh, there's a bug on my screen. Talk about a cat. Bug on my screen. Pounces. Well, there's my Fortnite sound. Let's get the Kyrie in here. Woohoo! Hi, welcome to the Vivid Valora show. How you doing? Huh? Hi, welcome to the Vivid Valora show. How you doing tonight? Hello. Are you ready? Did you say, did you say Vivid Valor show? I did. Look, I am very close to the edge of snapping. So, uh, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta get some joy and levity in here somehow. Oh, I have the sweat drop PNG on. Hold on, let's change that. <laughs> um, hold on, we're just gonna, we're just gonna <laughs> turn that off. I am a little the grumpy, talking. so we'll turn the grumpy on. The talking in, in, in the server is cracking me up because I'm getting the notifications from that. The Valora show has been announced. Yes, the Hold lovely on. AJ announced. The, let me, let me the lovely AJ Discord. announced it. You see Discord, 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 Discord. Give me the, give me, give me. And then, and then the lovely Emmy came into it. I quite like my new Twitch profile picture. I think it looks cute. Okay. Okay. Let's go. That's cool. Let me put my phone on the charger to make sure you know it doesn't croak during this. Yeah, it's not low. Idea. Fortnite just, you know, likes to drink my battery. Take your job seriously. Thank you for taking your job seriously, Ajax. The bad part is, I started just as one of my friends started streaming. The goal was to be streaming before he started streaming and finish before he started streaming. It did not happen. We ended up starting streaming at the same time. <laughs> Whoops. Which is fine, I suppose. <coughs> I'm kind of sad. Hmm. But like, eh, it happens. I can at least say I'm doing better now that the storm's gone. I was fixing to sass it. Gone. Hello, Celeste. How are you? <laughs> Look, I had to go to church to be the worship band sound man. Um, so the pack elder had tried to keep me from leaving. It was like, with that serious? downpour and that lightning. No, I'm like, Stop. I am going to do church work. Chill. <laughs> Wee. Okay, so, as always, I don't care what match quests we do. Uh, Frenzy of Shotgun, Lavish Leary Reach. Uh, we're gonna visit Lavish Leary Reach, 65 players remaining. Because that sounds decently <clears throat> achievable. I was about to say, if that's what you're doing, please put it on the map, and you put it on the map. So, thank you very much. <laughs> tired, Ella. Very tired, Wolf. Oh, but who's a good Wolfie? Who's a good Wolfie? Den is much cleaner. <laughs> Don't forget to thank your bus driver. I had to cut some of the tape off my phone so I can actually, like, see the thank you on my phone <laughs> for thanking the bus driver. <laughs> yes, you do need to play Fortnite. Yes, yes, you Celeste. Very good answer. You are a good wolfie. <laughs> oh, lovely. I think this is one of those places with a vault. Uh, yeah, we're fixing to land yeah. and then turn around and leave. 
sounds like a very lovely plan. I want I this blue gun. I want this blue gun. Okay, here we go. Okay, we're gone. Oh, crap. That was a sniper rifle. That wasn't even a useful weapon. Yeah. Butt face. Okay, <laughs> this way. Wasn't even useful for- I don't even have a weapon yet. That's fine. I love how I just hit the wrong button. I meant to go into slidey mode, and I went jump- Goodness gracious. Okay, let's get us some shields, shall we? And there's ammo, no weapon. Yeah, let's go this way. Hey game, game, if you could give me a weapon, that would be just mwah, chef's kiss great. <laughs> chef's kiss great. Playing Genshin right now, working on leveling Navia before my stream started. The goal is to get her as leveled as I can and use her in the artifact domain for stream. Ooh, fun! You can do it! Jeez, nope. we're still at 90 players remaining. Oh, oh, oh. You want some juice? What kind of juice? Uh, I got both kinds, actually. Let's do some juice. This is not the button I wanted. You know if you bust the bottom barrel, it'll actually bust the top barrel, too? It sounds like there's a chest somewhere. <laughs> Excuse you! I was here first! <laughs> Go you! I will take the cluster cleaner and give you the rifle. Thank you. Where'd you go? Okay, there you are. Way Boop. over here. I can get you up, it's fine. We just have to not die before 65 players remaining, and we're good. Can't believe you found a game that scares you just from watching a- Oh, wow! What game did you find that scares you just from watching a playthrough? So hard, you almost kicked <laughs> Alan out of bed. What did you find? Uh, wait, Celeste found one? Yep. Miss Ma'am, what, what did you find? Madison. Uh, look, I'm gonna be honest, that just a- mm, That sounds kind of freaky. Never heard of it. Come I'm supposed to say, I don't think this is English. It's not English. I, I, I thought correctly. Whee. What the mess? Are we already almost out of gas? I was using the booster. Oh. Uh. So then, yes, hey, we're already almost there. Mm -hmm. Nope. I really wish this would push out the other cars. Oh, it's missing a wheel. How nice. Oh well. <laughs> oh well. I fight against the ice. Hold on, there's been a lot in chat, and I cannot keep up while trying to drive. Alright. We medicine in the game Leo wants Ajax to play. Ah! <laughs> no. Leo was going to get it for me if it had gone on sale during October. He wants me to play it so bad. So scary. Totally want to play it. Okay, well, you can play that, and I'll point and laugh. Um. Well, we officially reached uh... 65 players remaining. Yep. Yay, I have a pistol. I like the pistol. What you got for me? Eh? Oh, take the hyper ambush us in the day. Eh. What you do you mean this? a crown bonus? I have a crown? What? Yeah. Oh my god, I didn't realize I had a yeah. crown. <laughs> Aim to entertain <laughs> with your screams. 
I've known the whole time you had a crown. I didn't realize I had a crown. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what quests I have, okay? <laughs> like, I have weekly quests. Look, I'm not judging you. I just found it funny. Milestones. <laughs> Uh, what are some weekly quests? I still gotta gain more oh, shields. That was an accident. My bad. Oh, that was you. <laughs> I was like, where are they? Yeah, that, 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 that be Deals me. Deals with opponents while on a train. Help defeat bosses. Help search cash registers to save. Deal damage to opponents while using ballistic shield. Eliminate players while you're airborne. What did I eliminate a player while airborne? I must have been in the middle of a jump. Uh, collect persons, trash. One person's trash is your treasure. Collect weapons dropped from opponents in different <coughs> named locations. Land on the train and eliminate an enemy player before you disembark. Interesting. Collect rare or better weapons at a hot spot. Collect food. Find and collect an epic or better item before doing damage. Yes, please dose. Acquire and equip a fully modified weapon in different matches. Hit a single enemy player with three different weapons. Interesting. Okay. We're just gonna... Wreck some noobs. Hey, look. I will wreck people that have been playing the game for ages. Because I've wrecked some people that have had, like, the first round, first chapter um, skins equipped. And I have wrecked very high level players. It's like they're on the road. Oh, they're moving away. Well, 49 now. <laughs> Collect food. Make progress toward the collect food. Can I just swap back and forth between the food items? Hold on. No. Can I throw apples? <laughs> oh my god, you can throw apples. Too bad you they can? can? Yeah. I don't know if they do damage, but you can throw them. Oh, hey, nice. Level up. You and your level up can hush up. <laughs> hey, at least I didn't do that little song that I like to do. There's a chest above me somewhere. Probably like right below me. Oh gosh, this one does not have any good sights. It is. This one doesn't have a scope. I think they're fighting bosses over there. Probably. We about to join? Nope. We see that ish and we're walking the other way. Fifty cal not have a scope, but my five five six does. That's stupid. Ooh, look at cash. <clears throat> You know, 
well, there's 27 players remaining, and we haven't come across another gosh dying person while out in the wild. We haven't shot at anybody. Nothing. Sometimes that, sometime that do happen. Well, it happens with me. But to be fair, I'll also play this by being a little sneaky sneak and snipering. I think this might be the longest I've gone without killing anybody in a game. Which is oh, sad. Oh, really? Yeah! Navy's talents are all level 5. Yes. We're gonna yep. pop shotgun. Oh, we're gonna force a striker. Uh, that is... Nope, we're gonna take that well. Hold on. Then we'll take the auto shotgun. Well, they just added in weapon modifications, which is why there's extra weirdness. Because now you can take weapons to a modification bench and actually add on scopes to stuff. So, it's actually kind of nice. Hold on. I'm going to go get them. Okay. Make them pay for their stupid <laughs> sniping. Where'd they go? Hold on. Oh, look, there's, there's your buddy. You... Never mind. I was about to, like, you want me to get down the one that you were originally going after? Nope. <clears throat> what weapons do I have? Regular, regular. What's up here? Some ammo. I will take that ranger pistol with the scope. Oh, hi, person! Where'd they go? Well, I have fifted. But there was a tree <laughs> between me and them most of the time. You want any of their, any of their loot? Because all I picked up was just the money. Nope. That was it. Do you want to hop on the train? Awesome. Sure. If I can actually hop on it. <laughs> Aw, I want to go inside the butt of the train. I need somebody else to get on the train so that I can murder <laughs> We're fixing to have to get off anyway. It's fixing to go into the storm. Three, two, one. This is Reckless Railways. Please disembark. Oh, crap. What? Did you get stuck? Hold on. I'm, I'm lagged Ooh. again. Why am I lagging so bad? That's fine. I was kind of <laughs> stuck in the, on the train a little bit. I love how I'm like, why am I lagging so bad? Like, um... A girl, your internet sucks because you live out in the middle of nowhere. That and the fact that it's raining and that does not help service at all. Yeah. Ooh, really. a nemesis Ahar. <sighs> oh, with the good scoop! Oh yeah. Yep, yep, yep. We're we're taking we're taking that. We're taking that. We're taking that. Okay, storm is moving. By the way, um. Yeah, I was actually about to be like, we need to get out of here. Yeah, I was working on figuring out which direction I wanted to go to get out of here. I am in town, so I want a shotgun. Whee! We are safe in the boundaries. Oh, 13 left. We...
We're going into gunfire. Why? Because apparently I have a death wish. <laughs> we Val, we're going into gunfire. Me? Why don't we not? Do you want me to hit you again? Ah, oh, did you blow my tire? You did. Was it just them? Nope. No, Where's the other? Else. That's who they were originally fighting that we interrupted the battle with. Ah, found them. Never mind. What? Oh, all right. Where's your little boyfriend? Oh, another person coming. Nice. Did you really think that was a smart idea? Goodness. This way. We got people incoming that have tokens, which means they fought bosses, which means they most likely have mythic weapons. Rock. Okay. Oh yes, the hazards of driving backwards. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, death by gas. Do we want to go to them or do we want to let them come at us? Because we can snipe from inside the what car. The? What? I'm in the back seat! I am in the back seat so that the car is not running. Because we essentially have a bunker. Okay. Oh god. That was a really nice shot with the Reaper Sniper. Uh, at least we placed third. Mm. Are you upset that we didn't win? Or are you upset at how quick we died from what they hit us with? I always get slightly upset, just like a little bit upset when someone kills me with a weapon that I I have a hard time using, period. Well, at least you picked up my crown. Uh, <laughs> uh, like, all props to him, though, because, I mean, to be fair, we were sitting ducks there. I didn't realize he had a reaper. A bird is the word. I said a bird, bird, bird. A bird is the word. What the? He's got six crown victories, dude. Dang. Goodness. I mean, to be fair, I kind of just handed him one on a golden platter by dying. <laughs> Alright, we're going to play one more, and then I will see if I can dig out my hand cam, and we will transition to coziness. I will be crocheting mm -hmm. and doing my nail pulls and, like... Trying to chillax and not murder people in real life. Um, there is a specific pack elder that I wanted to smother earlier because she would not stop talking. Oh my god, she ran her mouth, like, solidly. I could barely get a word in. Hmm. 
Was it that your Twitch went Nightcore for a sec, or is it that mine screwed up? Because honestly, with the way my internet's been today, with how wet and rainy and disgusting it is, I wouldn't be surprised if it was my internet that made it go Nightcore. Uh, what are we doing? Uh, I don't know. <clears throat> Thank you, bus driver. We're gonna go over here. Wait, hold on. I have blank map over here. Pivot to the left a little. Cause I saw- Pivot, pivot, pivot. Shut up, Ross. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be a moment. My cuticle rip so far it bled so Ooh. i'm gonna have a bloody finger while we're doing my nails it's so nice so nice so lovely try and catch up to you at least somewhat you're good you're good Okay, now that I at least know where you're going. Oh, apparently didn't matter. I hear shooting. Hello. Oh my god! Lag! Stop it. Please, stop it. Okay, I'm just gonna, oh my god, <laughs> I'm lagging so bad. Oh my god, we're in crossfire between two teams. Run, just run, just run, just run, just run. Okay. You have no weapons. And yes, I, I do. You do? What do you have? But we're caught in the crossfire between two teams. I do not want to deal with that this early in the game. <laughs> Whee! Oh, that was a bad idea. You I need fishy. Oh, amazing. never mind. No, I don't need there fishy. I need heals. I need, I need strip heals. Okay, do heals first and then have a fish. You know, I actually have two weapons, because where I landed, apparently they had already uh, gotten that chest. And they left behind two weapons, one of which I will actually use. The other one's just a shotgun that I'll use if I have to. Take that. <gasps> Thank you. And you can have the shield yeah. potion, too, if you can make it up there. Son of a biscuit, really? that was not me. Did they just chase us? They did, because that's the person that was following me earlier. Put you down like a rabid dog. Now see, that's what you get for chasing people. You could have waited for me. I thought you were right, like, behind me. No, because I have ADHD and I forgot those barrels were there and I continued moving so we didn't get shot in the back again. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, I legit thought you were, like, right behind me. I heard you move behind me, but then I didn't... I, I thought you stopped. Ew, a yacht. Landmark discovered. Ooh. Cleared another part of my map. Oh god. People, 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 NPCs, NPCs. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. 
Where are you? You look like a frenzy auto shotgun. Yes, please. I only see the one. Oh. What is that? What's what? Uh, blueberry fizz? What the crap? No idea. I took out the camera. Oh. Ooh, the master sword. <gasps> yes, please. Okay, that's it. Let's go. Somebody. Oh my god. Are we going? Hey, look, it's you! Ooh. You should have gotten that. You took down most of it. If you want them, I'll let you have them. Got him. Running gun, nice. hammer pump, shotgun. Mm. Yep. I don't want to take that. I'm wearing reinforcer AR. I'll keep my one with the a little bit of um. Let's see. Let's see if anything. Ooh, yeah. Look. Here's slurp. Excuse me, Kyrie, Ky Kyrie, can you get up here so we can bust this sleep? Yeah, uh, I'm coming, and after that, I found a little sum sum for you. Okay. <laughs> All right, come down here. Come, come in. What is this purple? <gasps> Eagle eye. Oh, with the good <laughs> scope! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> As soon as, I saw, as soon as I saw that, I was like, Val, Val needs this. Oh my Val gosh! It, pu it gives you, it gives you, it gives you a pistol when you have the stupid shield. Mm -hmm. Oh, cool. Yeah, I was like, I saw that, I'm like, Val needs this. I think one of my weekly quests is also deal damage while using a ballistic shield. Girl, I haven't even freaking done my weekly, my, uh, that's match quest, not weekly. Wee jump. Okay. I'm surprised I'm doing so good even with lagging and crap so much. I'm honestly not really that surprised. I'm not Celeste. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, we're like right in the middle of the Oh wow, we're in the middle of the storm. Nice. Huh? What? Oh, playing <laughs> playing really well with buffer. I mean not buffer, lag. Playing well with lag. I said I wasn't you. Cause you play so good with the uh, lag. I thought this let's say Celeste must be like what? what? Yeah, what she she she, what? she heard her name and she's like, huh? <laughs> Just like a dog. You know, it's kind of funny. I have been wanting to do my nails for like over a week now, and I just have not done them. Well, I finally ended up taking my um, glue-ons off because I'm very tired of them, and 
One of them broke off and like peeled it. And it was not good. Oh. Yeah, it was not good. That no fun. Meat. Oh. Whoops. Oh. So so, you you remember how I told you that my love. Lee husband's getting us both the uh, Steam Decks, right? Mm hmm I got to pick out what's going to be, like, essentially, like, the prettiness of my uh, Steam Deck whenever he does end up buying it. Nice. And it's it's a Galaxy Starry Blue one nice. off of Amazon. It's already been purchased we, along with his. We, we call that a, um... Take that giant daisy. So as you were saying, you said we we are we call that what? Um a lost train of thought. <laughs> a case. We call that a case. Yeah. So. It's it's not really like an actual case, it's more like a shell for it. It's like a sticky shell that like you just stick onto and it stays. We call that a decal. Yes. I could not remember the actual name for it, honestly. So, yep, that got purchased today. I see a back and forth gunfire, but I don't see any of the... He went to purchase it last night, but, uh, Bank apparently didn't like that. Uh, could you... Oh, well, got him down with a headshot. Let's see what else we can do, shall we? I just say that was hilarious. What? Oh, that was too, that was too funny. Let's see what else we can do. Murders both of them. Oh, we're both good. Okay. Mm. I really wish I had my precious. I like the eagle eye enforcer AR because not only can you snipe with it, but you can also um, hip fire it decently accurately too especially if you get one of the ones with a muzzle break on it oh. <laughs> you I'm hiring you we now have an NPC on our side ooh, ooh. why do we have supercharged XP when this isn't when this chapter isn't supposed to end until like May it's it's no, Fortnite. March. There's no... March, not there's, It's still... It's Fortnite. There's no telling. We are still in the center of the circle. Nice. Oh. Oop, what? I thought I heard gunfire. So... I do hear gunfire. It's up on the loot, um, loot island. Ah. Uh. Because the loot island's not too terribly far from where we're at. Oh, look at me just the way I'm sitting. Oh, that's better. Oh, it feels like my right foot's trying to go to sleep. There we go. Oh my god. Oh, hello. Got him. Or since it was a female skin, yeah. should I say got her? <laughs> got apostrophe E M. I want to see something. Oh yeah, that's the, yeah, that's definitely the one that I do not care for. Is that the giant reaper? Yeah, the reaper sniper yeah. rifle. But I will take you, gladly. I don't even care that you're just green. Oh look, incoming train. Wampa! Taxi! <laughs> I was, I, I was not behind the yellow line. Uh, <laughs> Ipsy. <laughs>
It is very hard to shoot. Off the train. Oh, you said off? Yes. Okay. O-F-F. -F. I'm off. I got it. It It's with how loud the train is and all the stuff coming through. It makes my uh, phone lag just a little bit. Oh. Yeah. Which is why every time you're like, let's get, time to get off. I'm like, what? Yeah, no, somebody was shooting at me, so I decided we would uh, hop off and shoot back. Yeah, no, fair. Totally fair. I have such poor. I was also trying to posture. find. I was also trying to find you because I'm like, if she said time to get off, then I'm not going to see her and I didn't see you. Oh, hello! What? Oh, hold on. You are in a bush. Okay, where's your... Where's your... Oh, behind the rock. Headshot, a limb. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm a good shot. Jeez I'm a good. Louise. Is that somebody on the top of the hill? I mean, I do that whenever I have a good sniper thingy. I will get up there and snipe. I couldn't tell if it was or not. I couldn't tell if it was fire coming down from there or just. Somebody's shooting upward from a cliff somewhere. Well, especially considering the fact that we have eight people left. Like, there's eight left. And it just did it for over here. I'm assuming, yes. Both. I just never realized that there were eight of us. Both, both, both. Somebody's coming up in a vehicle. I hear. You managed to dodge. Yep. I'm down. Oh, what the fudge? Oh god, I'm out. They had a legendary. There was. Mm -mm, nope. You said that was it? Yep, that was it. Good lord. Ever since you mentioned me playing with lag, all I can think of is <laughs> flying trees. <laughs> Ooh, look at these pretty <laughs> trees. Hey, I, I leveled up three times, Facebook. so. I saw a post on Facebook earlier. <laughs> it was so bad. <laughs> and it reminded me of that. Talk about making it to where, like, refrigerators can become a lot like, like those little, um... Those little uh, vacuums that are robotic. I make it to where, like, if you're like, I want food, refrigerator, come to me. It starts coming, and the thing, and the thing's <laughs> like, no, I don't need to be like in that state of mind. I think my refrigerator's chasing me. <laughs> oh. oh, I'm so, oh, like, I'm so close to the white tiger skin. Mm. Yep, sure enough, I got notified. But Laura invites you to. Yep. I had no clue you went live until, like, you're, until you mentioned something. Because you were like, I'm going to be streaming. I'm like, wait, does she mean, like, actually streaming? I was so confused. Also, page 12. I want the skin on page 12. I want, well, I, I want Valeria. At... Val wants Val, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Val wants Val. Very valid. Eh, get it? Oh my <laughs> god. Lord Jesus, help us. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> yeah, I've barely been working on locking anything anymore because I just don't have to stuff the thing for <laughs> I unlocked all the V-Bucks I could, and I don't care about anything else. 
well, I have crew, so I automatically get the battle pass. Um, I've been more focused on getting games that aren't Fortnite recently. Fair enough. Uh, I mean, I still like Fortnite. It's a great stress relief. Oh, look! Another place where my cuticle ripped and bled. The hair. Ooh. I, I still like Fortnite, but, like, for the most part now, I, I only really play it with, like, other people, and that's really it. It's good stress relief when somebody gla- won't, um, stop talking. Like, today. I mean, that's valid. I thought my glasses broke for a minute. I'm like, look, they don't need to break any more than they already have. <laughs> I don't have the insurance current. Well, technically I do, but yeah, not do. with the doctor I want, so... Aw, is your eye doctor not in network with your... Nope. I oh, know. And I won't have them back in network until I switch insurances again. Um, who does your insurance cover your eye exam with anybody? Because I know a lot of insurances will actually do, like, full coverage for an eye exam. Yeah, they they covered... Vi- they cover vision it's just not through the doctor that i go to okay i'm so confused with you and how your insurance works so i'm gonna just let you do it i'm gonna stop talking um yeah it, again not not all doctors take all insurances even within medicaid not all doctors take all insurances so like he takes three different versions of medicaid health insurance and then the other ones he does not take those he does not offer any services to those which is and the one i switched to to get which is why i said i'm gonna just let you handle it because i don't have medicaid i have my parents insurance which is actually really good insurance so i don't have to worry about it for another a lot of two years a lot of insurance that isn't medicaid a lot of it's really good insurance Medicaid's nice when you can't really afford to have your own insurance. It's nice. It's just really stinking. Well, annoying. if healthcare wasn't a scam, then insurance wouldn't be a problem. But healthcare is a scam. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, that's why I say my current eye doctor, because I'm not going to switch from him just because of my insurance. Even though your glasses are broken? My... Yes. Because if I switch from him as soon as my insur- as soon as I switch my insurance again to the one I want, I'm gonna be going right back to him. Got you. I'm attempting he's to the use only- my foot to grab the box that I need to find my hand cam. This is hilarious. Did you say to find your hand cam? Yes. Okay, making sure I heard you right. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, that was a lot of stress on my toes. Okay. Let's see, where is it? Uh, not where it's supposed to be. But yeah, also, to be fair, one of the one of the current insurance is like a brand new insurance that not a lot of people are really trusting yet. Fair enough. Um, like brand new as of like the last like year or two. So. Uh, the one brain cell cat that one has I... um, lost her one brain cell as well as her hand cam. This is an issue. Where did I put it? Where did I put it? Oh my god. Lord Jesus, <laughs> help me. Show me the way to my camera. Oh, look! My USB C box. And I can have another fast charger. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Lord, for that. Mm-hmm. Not what I was looking for, but thank you. Another Xbox One controller, though. Not what I need. Um, and now I have a mess. Okay, cool. Great. Love it. <coughs> Ugh. My lungs do not like me after earlier. Why? What was earlier? I might have had... Okay, so you remember the thing that was suggested yesterday, right? With with adding spaghetti with the spaghetti sauce. I mean, that too. Okay, yeah. Well, it was so stinking delicious. And for the first time since I've had the soup, my stomach didn't feel like it wanted to die. Okay. 
so I made it again for lunch today. Okay. Well, and between I like all that, like, and between like all that sippiness, and then me having a glass of milk and whatnot, I I guess like all that caused like more phlegm or something. I don't know, but like I've been coughing like half today. I am so sorry. You guys are just hearing Kushuka, Kushuka, um. You came back to me losing my brain cell, Ajax. You know, Cell, you could just kick Rue out since her butt is having a villain arc. You don't have to put up with that. Her butt? Rue's butt's what? Having a villain arc. She's gassing them <laughs> really bad. Okay, we're just gonna Okay, so... So, so if you can... <gasps> Oh, poor Sal and Alan. Poor Dale. <laughs> but that's a lair. Where? Oh, where? But she's so cute. Her butt and farts aren't cute. Okay, so if the handstand isn't there... Okay. Oh, where did I, put it? I know what I'm eating for dinner. Oh, Alan's in the living room. <laughs> Send her to Alan and have her gas him out. Is it underneath my computer? No. Is it... I have no idea. I legit have no idea where I put my hand cam. This puts the damn wrong things. It's hard to do a hand <laughs> Oh, my dear, sweet baby Jesus, I found it. Hold on. Was it right in front of you? I put it away. Just not where I thought I put it away. <laughs> oh. I was about to say, if it was a bad snake, it would have bit you. Uh, no, it's on the other side of the room, so it would have been outside striking distance. Uh, <laughs> ah. Um. I kind of, I kind of hid it from myself because I put it over with another tall item. Mm. So I kind of hid it Got from you. myself. Um, Good job. Let me remove that because that could technically dox me. Um, put that there, put that there. Trying to figure out how we're going to do this. Okay. Do we want a side view, front view, view from my angle? How, how we want this? How we want this? I'll let you guys have opinions. What was the options? <laughs> I'll give a verbal option for now. What was the option? It was, um, do we want, like, um, hand cam from above, from looking, like, from the computer, um, towards me? Do we want, um, like... I'd say above, if possible. Or, like, from directly in front of me to where, like, you're looking at the same angle I am. Above? Okay, hold on. That means I gotta get, that means I gotta get my precarious stacking vessel. Because I'm, I'm assuming you're about to, like, exit out of Fortnite. Yes. Which means, okay. um, you're fixing to go bye bye. I know. Sad. I'm not going bye bye. I'm just moving. <laughs> <laughs> you're vocally going bye bye. Alright. Let's see. Let's close out Fortnite. Confirm. Close Fortnite. Okay. That also means we can get our. Stream up here. Let's also get some kind of ambience to listen to. Ooh, y'all gotta be in the chat uh, instead of in the vocal box. What? That didn't make any sense. We're good. I just have lost every brain cell I pretended to have. Okay. Uh, okay, so we're gonna 
this is a precarious situation here. I'm using a taller tumbler than last time, so hopefully this will go better than last time. Um, I did not want a live intermission. I am so Hold on. Hold on. I forgot to hit studio. Scuff. Scuff. Scuff, 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 scuff. I have one brain cell and it ran away. Um. <laughs> Uh, the camera is there. I don't know. They're having even more scuff. I'm so sorry, y'all. Okay, here it goes. I just had to change it. <laughs> I don't think if you're hungry is a decision. I think your body makes that for you. Um, let's scoot this oh wait no we'll just move my water glass and put this where my water glass is because my water glass is pretty centered on the desk um this is in fact a better angle than last time i'm i'm trying to do this now so that you guys aren't getting like sick or dizzy and can actually still see me working Da, 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 da. Well, your body will tell you if you're hungry or not, so you shouldn't have to make a decision because your body should tell you. And if your body can't decide, then you're probably not hungry. You're probably bored. Let me become ungrumble Gus. Sushi, sushi. Bada bing, bada boom. Hands. Cord, because I'm not using a Bluetooth headset. Dwinks. Do you have hydration? Do you have. Are you hydrating? I will threaten you with bottles. Are you hydrating? Well, even cactuses have to drown at some point, Celeste. Here you go. Ooh, tube. The deep, dark hole. Okay. Chocolate. Chocolate from Spain, I believe. Okay, so we're doing nails before we crochet. Pardon me talking with my mouth full. I have lots of nails to choose from. Lots of nails to choose from. And fangs! Okay. So you guys sit here and look at the nails and tell me which, you, which one you guys want to see. Also, with the way I have the camera set up, the bottom to me is the bottom to you guys. So this was the correct choice for the camera. <sighs> okay, what kind of ambience do we want? We kind of want something cozy. Meow. 
Meow. Meow. Meow. No! Gosh darn it. I missed the moth. Alright. Anybody have any kind of preference about what kind of, uh, what kind of, what kind of what? I just hit a scratch in my record in my brain. Um, what kind of music we want? Crackle Fireplace? Crackle Fireplace. Crackle Fireplace. Crackle Fireplace. Crackle Fireplace. No copyright music. Here we go. Turn it up in my headphones just a bit. Here we go. Top far left, these. Hold on. Figure out. There we go. Okay, what's everybody else's opinions? This is a democracy after all. <laughs> is the music at an okay volume or do I need to turn it down? You go top ghosties. Is that is that this top ghosties? Is this, is this the one that you were voting for, Celeste? The dark green with flames? Your phone freaks all the time. That's nothing new. Okay, so Kyrie, which 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 nails do you think? Do I need to actually lift them up so that Kyrie can see them? Hold on. Da -da 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 -da. Since you're on a pretty small one. Okay, there's a good overview of the other four. Eight sets of nails. Six, eight, ten. Yes, I have ten different sets of nails. <laughs> and this is the regular impress, so I'm betting they'll probably come off fast because I've been losing the impress ones really fast recently. Don't know why. That's Emmy said because they're pretty. Okay, so we have two votes for this one and one vote for this one. If they were the same shape, then I would mix them together, but these are a coffin and these are an almond. Why do I have so many dancing dinosaurs, Celeste? Why are there so many dancing dinosaurs? Why are there so many dancing dinosaurs, Celeste? Why are there so many dancing dinos? Oop, that's the wrong set. Because you can. And y'all tell me if my head ends up peeking into view and getting in y'all's way. I'm trying hard not to, but... Oh no, I, I got plenty of wiggle room. Especially if I pull my hand up here. Clip the cuticles that ripped. I forgot my nail file. I grabbed my cuticle oil but forgot my nail file. Nice. Is that 
really a crusty band of glue. It is. I'm just gonna snip that dead. Whoop! Dead skin and glue off. Okay, back to Dozen Yuga. Okay, love you too, Celeste. Bye. Look how rough and jagged my nails are from where they grew out. Oh, this isn't autofocus. I'd have to do it. Stay up until you finish stream so we can play Stardew, but it's bedtime for this start. I'll knock out in a few minutes. Yeah. Hey, at least you're going to bed pretty much on time. You put me on quietly since I have, um, since I have lo-fi music on, so just have me in the background. I don't think I'll be talking too much. I also got started streaming later than I intended, and for that, I do apologize. I had meant to be streaming at 7, but the pack elder just had to be difficult. I also have a doctor's appointment tomorrow, and I'm not happy about it because the pack elder has a function that she wants to go to really bad, and it's like her one social time, so I kind of have to take her. But like, normally we don't get home until like 2, 2.30 and my doctor's appointment is at 1.30. So I have to try to shepherd her and have her eat quickly and stuff. Navy up to level 66 already, so she'd be nice and high level for the build stream Saturday. Yay! Yes, 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 yes! Good job on getting Navy at high level. Just clip my calluses up the sides of my nails. <laughs> I'm sorry that my hands are out of focus and that the desk is in focus because I don't feel like messing with the focal distance right now. It's annoying on this camera because you have to hand adjust the focal distance. not knocking out yet yeah I even have cuticle oil I'm trying to decide if I want to do the cuticle before I put on the fake nails or after probably should do before that way I can get the oil all over my nails and then dehydrate them and clean them off from the oil. That way I'm not putting on oil afterwards and making the glue loosen from oil. I 
actually really like this music. It's very nice. Yeah, it's also listed as a free BGM, so it's free background music that doesn't have any copyright on it. So I definitely need to save this for later. I also need to go to this person's page because they're in my alpaca BGM studio, so they might have more no copyright background music, which would be nice. I'm trying to get this like little stubborn and stiff and pokey part. It never wants to come off. Get clipped, sucker. Did I get it? I think I got it. Not me just biting it off because I can't get the clippers in at a good angle. <laughs> Alright, not the clip where this one's ripping down. That way I stop picking at it, hopefully. It's the goal at any rate. Actually, I think my nails are just long enough. I could actually like paint them, paint them. But it's 9.23. I don't think I want to do that this late at night. So press on as it is. Ow. That hurt. Okay. We're good. We are clipped. Now I need to grab the gas file. Oh, darn, it didn't make a nice pop noise like it did earlier. Whoop. Almost avalanched my box of nails off into the floor. <laughs> Ow. Mm. I gotta call the doctor's office. I meant to do that today and I forgot. Cause I gotta set me up an interest appointment. My filling is painful, and my filling should not be painful. Back in the appointment tomorrow. Gotta make a business appointment. Gotta make a vet appointment for the dogs. Gotta make a doctor's appointment for the pack elder. Oh my god. Life sucks right now, dudes. I'm tired of adulting. So tired of adulting. Quick, call the vet. Everyone's having issues. <laughs> yes. Yes. So, would you need an astrologist since you're star- Oh, wait, you're not having any problems. Never mind. Or do you go to an astrophysicist? It wouldn't be so bad if more places would let you make appointments online. Like for the doctor's office, good lord, just say I need an appointment, let me select what my appointment's for, let me give you my name, and let me tell you what day and time I want, if it's available, 
can give you like my date of birth to go along with it. Just like check against your records and make sure it's really me. Like, how hard is that? Okay, nails are now smooth on that hand. You know what? I'm gonna have to drive past the vet tomorrow. Let me just stop in and by the vet and make appointments in person. Another one of your nails broke? No! Rude. You need to get my poly gel kit out and do you poly gel that way you don't have to worry about your nails. Just give you fake long right nails. <laughs> no patience. What was that? I think it was. No, Papa Lard just arrived safe. After going from one apartment to the other. What am I imagining? <laughs> you could have- oh my god, is that scary? Maybe I shouldn't do that. scary. And you just go fucking like, I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. No, you're not a bully. You wouldn't do anything bad. Oh, but matching red claws would be cool. Don't cry. Don't cry. No. I have upset her royal majesty of the stars. I'm sorry. Ow, 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 ow. That's nail bed. That's exposed nail bed. We're past the snimful sobs and straight to the crying harder. No, no I've upset her royal majesty. I'm trying. Okay. So we are filed. We are eating spicy chicken. I would like to do a good thing. the phone yet, Ajax? Am I on the phone yet? 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 <coughs> yay! Yay phone! Yeah, 
last ones. We're just gonna have issues. Can a moderator get that, please? It's not letting me do stuff. Oh, wait, there we go. There we go. There we go. Got it. being rude it didn't want to let me do stuff it didn't want to load the button uh for moderation on twitch you should poke their name and then it should pop up a little banner and then it'll have like a the big circle with the slash through it and that's the band button See what I'm doing. Hold on. Let's just see. Squeeze. Excuse me. Excuse me. Nail oil. Could you come out? Thank you. Honestly, could do with like a pedicure. I kind of want to save up my money and actually like go get a professional pedicure, though. I also want to save up and actually go get like a full set of acrylic nails and actually do like acrylics, acrylics. Because I've thought about doing. Because we have a salon here in town that does about seventy dollars for a full set of acrylics. And I've considered going and getting it done like once a month and going like every four weeks as like a treat. But that, good lord, that's like a tenth of my salary for taking care of the pack elder, though. So I'm not sure. Actually, I'm so sorry, keyboard. I'm so sorry, keyboard. Flaming Hot Cheetos, by the way, in case anybody was curious what spicy chips I have. I wish there was some French onion dip, because Flaming Hot Cheetos are really good with French onion dip. I wonder if they'd be good with ranch. By the way, we're letting the cuticle oil sit. That way, the skin has more time to absorb the cuticle oil. to bed going for you, Ajax. Are you actually in bed? You 
flame started before bed. Laundry is definitely important. I have a pile of unfolded laundry. Uh oh. That's not good, Kyrie. I'm so sorry. out there to fix the dryer again again is that the frowny roll eyes emoji Camera's crooked. It is. Hold on. Let me just. Whoop. Nope. That's more crooked. Here we go. And I fixed you. Y'all should be straight now. Or as straight as you fruitcakes can be. Ah! These are really good. These are the baked ones. Very good. Ew, ew, ew. Oh, God. Oh, God. That's a bad decision. <gasps> my finger still tastes like acetone from where I cleaned my nail, uh, my fake nails off and cleaned the glue off my nails. <laughs> So, oh, I just licked my finger and oh, it just tastes like pure acetone. <coughs> a spicy acetone is not a good combo. Speaking of which, I don't have my acetone to clean my nails. That's a problem. I will, um, I did bring that on myself. Hold that. <clears throat> Hold that though. doing hmm. what are you gone time to open flavorful drink to 
on. One second again. Acetone on a freaking open sore. That's not gonna feel good. Since the oil was on it, it wasn't that bad. Every once in a while, this background music is so freaking cute. The first time it meowed, I thought that the cat was in here. And I was like, oh my god, really? Stand near half of the house. Cat. Christmas presents from. <gasps> need to have money so he can go to the post office and send Ash for their Christmas presents. This one has a spooky graveyard. He can't see it. Well, actually, he can kind of see it. Barely. It's fuzzy. <laughs> you don't even remember what you're getting. Well, that's good then. It'll be a, it'll be a nice surprise for you. <coughs> I don't wear a size zero. Size one. 
is two. That's normally one of my thumbs, if not both of my thumbs. That's not is three. That's normally too small for my thumbs. All right, let's try size two. Make sure size two are fitting in this set because it varies from set to set the size. So like on some designs, I'll be a two. On some designs, I'll be a size three. It looks like a size two will be the right size for my thumbs in this set. Oh, my nose is running. Yeah, and then you wear like, hold on. Then your thumbs are like, this size. Like, teeny tiny. <laughs> Anyway, Boop. All right. I sh okay, I need to find accents and see what sizes the accents are. So there's two flames. That one's a regular ombre. Ombre flame. Ombre, giant ombre, 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 flame. Is there only one with a graveyard? Oh no, these both have graveyards. Okay. I'm about to be very sad if only one nail. <laughs> Actually, no, you're right. Her thumbs might be more like this one. <laughs> Actually, that's the tin, which is normally the size I wear on that nail. <laughs> I love how I just, like, randomly grabbed one to make fun of Kyrie, and I actually grabbed the right size for my pinky. <laughs> And my right pinky is actually bigger than my left. My left pinky normally wears a size small. Ooh, wow, my 11's too small this time. What? Are both my pinkies gonna be a size 10 in this set? Oh my god, they are. My pinkies are a size 10. Oh my goodness, it's so big. <laughs> Okay, so what sizes? Okay, so the tree and graveyard are a size six. Flames are a size five and size seven. <laughs> Ajax, you are terrible. I'm not mad about it though. I was kind of thinking that too. I just didn't say it. Shall I read out what you said? just so that anybody that can't actually watch it can hear what you said. <clears throat> and that's what she said. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I had to read it in a funny voice. We probably all were thinking it. I don't like what sizes these are because my pointers are normally an eight in this style and then my middle and my ring are size five and six respectively and I've been wanting to do all three 
three of them as flames, but it looks like I'll only be able to do middle and ring. And looks like middle will be size five. And yep, the ring will be the graveyards on a number six. Let's double check and make sure the right hand side's the same. Yes. But sometimes the right hand's different, sometimes not. Let me try really hard not to flip you guys off. Okay. And then I'm gonna need. Will the sevens fit? No. Oh gosh. Y'all, that it's like so much overlap. There's literally a gap in between like my sidewall. That is comically too big. Like, it didn't even curve downward around the edge of my nail. It was like over the edge of my nail and hitting the skin. It's comically too big. should be okay. Yeah, okay. Pointers are eights. Like, no. Oh, that's spicy. Oh, that just hit me in the back of the throat with the spicy. That's spicy. 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 so spicy it's making my nose run. Maybe I won't eat both bags of spicy chips that I have in here. Although I do have other snacks that I can turn it down. Ooh, some chips. Let's mix chicken tacos. I didn't even think about the fact that it kind of like them. Mmm. Oh yeah, some chips cool my mouth. so that I can see it. I'm nearsighted, y'all. Go ahead and push my cuticles back. Oh, my nose is running. since I last did my nails. Clean the blood off the nail. Beauty. 
Pretty is pain. Make myself pretty for Jesus. Because people accept you more if you're pretty. And I want to get accepted by as many people as possible so I can spread Jesus to as many people as possible. Piece of cuticle is peeling. Almost to bed. Woohoo! Ready for bed. Oh, I forgot that I switched to the Twitch only chat instead of the multi stream chat. I'm normally working out going to bed right now. Like, I've normally brushed my teeth, washed my face, all that. But I stayed in bed and saved my energy this morning, and I drank a Red Bull across several hours, so I'm not very tired right now. Bye. Mm -hmm. 
I wish the fireplace was a little more prominent. Because, like, when the music gets low, you can hear the fireplace. Let's get this. Get off. Please get off. Please get off. Please get off. That's okay. Thank you. Push the cuticles back with the edge so that you slide up underneath the cuticle. Gently do it. Make sure you have it lined up right. Then press not out of it. Yeah, because this is the impref line, which means the harder you press, the better it sticks. Supposedly. Oh, this is also glow in the dark. I wonder what glows in the dark. I have a really bright flashlight. I might see if I can charge it and see if we can see what the glow in the dark is. Probably set up to where this jelly looking portion there is a glow in the dark so that you get a um, silhouette of the uh, graveyard. That's my guess. Because this green does not really look like it's very glow in the dark. It just looks like a traditional ombre. It doesn't have like the glow in the dark quality to it from the looks of it. But we'll see. But yeah, I'd almost bet money that it's the graveyard. I have to clean my right nails again. I ended up touching them with my fingers. Ooh, oh, oh, y'all, this one has, this one has the, um, freaking fencing of the graveyard. That one has the fencing of the graveyard behind it. Okay, so what does the bigger one have on it? Is that another of the fencing? That would be kind of cool. I started to flip you off and be like, does that look straight to you? <laughs> Walk out of my house in Surrey Valley. It's summer day one. Oh no! Summer day one. Oh man, do you have any summer seeds that you can plant right quick before you go back to bed? At least plant and water like two flowers. Plant you some sunflowers. I think you said you had some sunflower seeds. Please get off of me. Clear for her. Oh my gosh! Sunflowers in the pot, pot. Yes, do the sunflowers in the pots by your house stairs. I try to be big brain. I try. I do my best to be big brain. I like these nails. I hope they don't catch on my keyboard while gaming too bad and pop off real fast. That would be so good. But I mean, look how long I had the other ones on though. Oh, but the other ones were like regular glue-ons of the impress though. 
So we'll see how long these last. I might have to swap to only getting the short length and press. I love the almond shape of the mediums though, because you can't get the almond shape in a short. 20 by 20 commercial field. 12 home blocks. Your stardew farm is massive. Is that one that we can co-op on? Or not, since I don't think Stardew has cross-platform yet. Never mind. Because that one's on your Switch. Okay, this is the one that I always get crooked. So let's me scooch in real close. Y'all can see my Coffee and Jesus shirt. Here we go. Okay, do you want me to pull out my switch right quick and I can hop on and we can do a little bit of um, Stardew Valley switch co-op? I don't know if my switch is charged though. Shoot. Is that, is that straight? I can't tell if that's straight. I think that's straight. Just stops halfway through doing my nails to play Stardew Valley. This is the easy part though. I have the sizing done, so it's just sticking them on. Oh, darn. Yeah, you go to bed. We'll co op tomorrow. Let's co op tomorrow. We'll call up tomorrow and I'll help you get going on day two of summer, but now we still have help. Ta-da! Fingies! Poisonous black and green fingies. Rawr, 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 rawr. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's completely dry. Day two is when you used to plant anyway. Okay, cool. So yeah, I'll hop on tomorrow on Switch, which means I need to make sure I plug up my. I need to plug up my switch before I go to bed. Oh yeah, the pack elder was sassing me for baking earlier, right before she went to bed. She was like, you need to get sleep too. And I'm like, pack elder, I don't go to bed until 10 to 11 p.m. That is three to four hours from now. It's not going to keep me up any later than I'm awake already. She was like, well, how do you have so much energy? Where do you get your energy from? And I'm like, because I sleep later in the day. I go to bed two to three hours later than you do and then get up two to three hours later than you do. If not longer. Because sometimes Pack Elder will be up at like 4 a.m. And I was like, see is you. You need to be in bed right now. You are an old lady. I love her to death, but sometimes she gets on my last ever loving nerve. Peach the snot out of it so that it sticks better. These actually feel like really, really secure. Actually a little more secure maybe than what they usually feel like. So I'm hoping these stay on really good because these are like super cute. I 
just gotta make sure not to like press on the tip and downward and like lever enough. That's what really gets me is like catching them like the tips and press while doing things. That's what really gets me so bad. So I like start lifting at the cuticle. Ugh. It's the worst. By the way, my desk mat is neoprene, so you don't have to worry about the acetone sitting on the desk mat. It's not gonna hurt it. Does that look straight? Oh, wow. Man, what is up with me getting all of these straight on, like, the first try? This is, like, a miracle. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus is like, you got viewers. Let's let this go good for you. I will not turn that down. Try not to flip you guys off. Or if I want to go Midwestern, we can say use guises or use guys. Although I think I like this native southern y'all better than use guys. Although I think sometimes I say that too. <laughs> Which is really funny. <laughs> That's not out of it. I want to come over to the observatory tomorrow for afternoon tea. Uh, okay, so 4 p.m. So that would be just after your. Sh no, you don't stream on Tuesdays anymore. You're only streaming on Saturday. Can we bump afternoon tea to like 2 2 30? If we can bump it to like 2, 2.30, I will bring over cookies to have with the tea. Oh, you are streaming on Tuesday? I thought you were streaming on- are you streaming twice a week? I thought you were only streaming once a week. Yeah. Cause if I come over for afternoon tea, I'm gonna like wanna sit and talk and like watch a couple of YouTube videos. Can we move this dream to Thursday? Or move tea to Thursday? I just can't do anything in the later afternoon cause I gotta make sure the pack elder has her dinner early enough that she doesn't have really bad ass street clothes. But she will get really bad acid if she eats too close to a bed. I want to do stress tea stream can scoot. Okay, so we'll do tea tomorrow at like two to two thirty. Does that sound good, my beautiful star? Please don't let this one be crooked. Please don't let this one be crooked. Please don't let this one be crooked. Oh my god, it's not crooked. What? One more to go and I don't have a single crooked one. Do a chatting stream replacement Stardew or some music competition. Ooh. Nice. 
I would be totally down for a chatting in Stardew. HSR? Ah. What is the HSR short for? I'm blanking. And I'm terrible at acronyms. Oh, Honkai Star Rail. Okay, that would explain why I was, couldn't figure it out. I don't really play Honkai Star Rail. I have it downloaded, I just don't play it. Isn't Honkai like an MMORPG? Like, there are other people on the server? Like, all the time? Or is that a different one that I'm thinking of? Use my one grain cell power. Oh, okay. Turn based tension. Cool. Oh my god, I think I got that one straight too. <gasps> I did. Tower of Fantasy. Okay. Y'all. I just got every single one of these nails on straight on the first try. What? Hold on, where's my excited? Oh, I have level. I don't have an excited sprite. <gasps> How do I not have an excited sprite? I'll do shocked though. Just, <gasps> I did it. <laughs> we'll go to lovable. No, it's pitch the snot out of it. Great. So now we go back down the line from first to last. So left pinky, pinch. Left ring pinch. Left middle pinch. Left pointer pinch. Left thumb pinch. And yes, in case you're curious, yes, this does make your pinching fingers hurt. Because I'm like, you, you see how white, there's like, I'm pinching the snot out of it for reals. And then right pinky. Yeah, that is insane. I like never get them straight on the first try. I usually have one or two that are crooked, but I really do think I got every single one of these on straight. That right pinky feels a little weird though. I think the glue tab might have been slightly crooked in the nail. Because it feels like there's a little bit of a gap along this outside edge. Look how nice this looks. Hold on, let me gather up my turn and throw it in the trash. Get a 
little, little ASMR in there for the Kyrie. I know she likes it. Now to file off where they have them in the molds. That way the tip is nice and Just get along the top and skin the crop. The top I did. <laughs> it's good. Hold on, I'm trying to get y'all to you so you can actually see what I'm doing and actually have something interesting to look at. <laughs> Though I don't know how interesting watching a little hand file go back and forth is. Yeah, that glitter is rough. There we go. That's smooth. I don't think it took off any of the shape. In fact, it looks like the glitter went over. Darn it, I pulled it closer to my face to where you guys can't see it in. Let me get my face closer. You have 271 hours logged. Wow, that is a lot of Stardew hours. What year are you on on that one? Aren't you on like year seven or something crazy like that? Oh my gosh. 
You shocked me so hard I dropped my nail file. Do you have all four flames from Grandpa yet? I still don't have a perfect um, farm for Grandpa. I don't know what I'm missing. But like, even like my big, um, even my big farm, like, no. And Alan's that one that's freaking, he's only on year three and he has a perfect farm for grandpa. And I'm like, what am I not doing right? And I'm like, is it just cause I'm not married or something? <laughs> Yeah, this pinky is loose. I think I'm gonna lose it. I don't, I don't know how long it's gonna last. It feels funny, it feels funny. <sighs> All right, Valora, be careful of your right pinky claw. I almost name dropped myself. What animal types you have, how many hearts you have with villagers, how high your skill levels are. Well, most of my skills are maxed out, so I'm going to say it's hearts with villagers. That's my issue then. This is making me want to bust out my stardew. But after this, I'm gonna crochet a bit and then go to bed. Because your girl needs a seriously long cat nap. Okay, well then yeah, it's probably just that I need to give people more gifts. Start giving everyone but the children wine and giving the children candy. <laughs> Let me turn off my level full sprite and I'll see if I can have the sprite on it. Ooh, I've been buzzed. Who's that what? Oh. 10.30 Ajax, it's bedtime for you. I'll try to be quiet so you can just chill out to my music. are perfectly good for scratching. Angle. 
I need this one actually get the one that's got a really bad tab. Scuffed that nail real good. He gets the mastery scuffs. But streaming's not the only thing I have scuff with. <laughs> Fountain pen maintenance. So, uh, the two things I have is I need to ink this one, and I think this one is probably gonna get black ink because I need a good broad nib black. This is a Twisby. Um, I want to say this is a Twisby swipe, but this one writes really well. It was just very dry. <laughs> Look, the sun sets too, so we're just rotating away from you. Good night, Ajax, my lovely star. Have a good sleep, your highness. You can have your shirt going, Oh, thank you. A broad nib twisty. I don't know why I'm holding my hand here. Like it'll focus. It's not gonna focus. Hold on. Can I actually get closer focus, please? Wrong way. Wrong way. Wrong way. Wrong way. Wrong way. Here we go. Broad nib. Where's the focal point? There's the focal distance. So probably get inked in black. And then we have this one that was actually a that is a handmade pen. Um, it is an insert, so the barrel is hand turned. It is a knot of wood that was dyed turquoise and then hand turned and then had insert a metal insert that goes in the middle put through it so that the nib and butt can get screwed onto it so this is the body of it and you have your end cap which this is actually reversible so this screws onto either end This one has a really pretty blue ink and his cartridge is over there 
Actually, it's a converter. It's a twist converter, not a cartridge. But it is riding extremely fine, and it's trying to skip. So, um, let me see. Can I get you guys even more close up? you can see it on camera but there's like a little slit because this is the breather hole this is what allows air part of what allows air back up into the pin so you bring it comes out so from this breather hole you have a little slit that the ink runs down and the ink runs through the feed and then when it hits that breather hole it runs through that channel in between your two tines. So if you have a wider slit, then you can have a juicier ink flow. So this one I like, and I'm gonna keep it just like that. But since this one, that little dark slit, even like that's like non-existent on this pen. So what I need to do is slip a piece of acetate, which is a very, very thin, very fine plastic. I don't even know if I have a piece of it. I gotta see if I find one. Um, but slide a piece of acetate in between the two tines to expand the slit in between the tines so, you, so I have a wetter flow to my nib. So that it's more usable and doesn't turn out super scratchy. So that's what I'm fixing to do. Is ink up one and fix a nib. Boom! Now you're back in focus here. Let's get you straightened back out. So first we're going to eat a chip. I think I should a box that has a thin film of acetate on it. Just one second. Nope. That's bigger than what I want. Did I not see the piece of acetate the last time? Okay. I'm fixing to go under the desk and see if it's in the film and box. of the fountain pen box. This is my hoard. This is mostly inks. The fountain pens are here and in my backpack. So let's go through here and let's see if we can find a piece of acetate that I'm pretty sure I saved. So we're gonna go for a minute. for my Pilot Metropolitan in it. That's empty. <coughs> hey look! Another menu box. This one, however, does have stuff in it. This one might have... Yeah, this one does have, like, product information in it. And I think I just got attacked by a couple of shrimp. Cartridges. Meow. Metallic reflexes. Did not catch those. Boom. So, this is actually trash. It was always. It was 
hoarding a piece of trash. <laughs> Did I sneeze? Why is there a bless you in chat? Ooh, this might could work. That's a little thicker than what I would prefer though. Here is the ghoulie pin flesh. When water alone isn't enough, it is a cleaner for your family pens. Some document inks from the look of it. Yep. All my little sample vials. Oh, that was a cough from Spicy Chips. Samples, samples, more samples. Well, these aren't samples. These are actually the Diamine Inkvent calendar bottles. Because um, every year for the past like three or four years, Diamine has done an inkvent calendar. So you get 24 of the little tiny bottles with brand new, never been done before colors, and then a full size new color. Um, and this year's are all so pretty, and I was like, I gotta have it. Dad, can I have it? Dad, can I have it? Please, please, please. And he was like, okay, you can have it. And I was like, oh, thank you. Oh, I do have a piece of acetate. Is it the very bottom? You gotta get to it through all of the little mini bottles. Hold on. There's nails. This might be difficult. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Ooh, wait, wait. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, dang it. Hold on. It was being obstinate. It is like that super thin plastic that they use as windows. Yes, Papalar the Generous. I thought you were trying to go to bed, ma'am. Talking to me is not having a stream in the background. Also, I have a pen inked up with this. I don't know how to pronounce it. It's J-A-C-A-R-A-N-D-A. -A -A -A. So Jacaranda or something like that. Um, unless it's, um, Mexican, then it's Jacaranda. Um, I, I apologize to all the Spanish speakers out there. That was for humor purposes only. Um, uh, please do not take me seriously. hear something about Popular and got summoned. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to make you up, honey. Allow my dulcet tones to soothe you back to sleep. Jax has a fireplace that she loves. That is a purring cat in the fireplace. Let's see if I can find where she where I saved it after she sent it to me. A purring cat. <laughs> a purring cat and a butterfly. It's maybe a little meal up to dreamland. After all that digging, I'm just 
squeeze in my nails to make sure they don't come off. We have a thin little flimsy piece of acetate. I turn it perfectly on the edge of the camera. You like can't see it. So what we have to do is we have to fit this in between the tines and get it slid down to hold it open for a little while to try to flex the tines apart and have them flexed far enough that if they don't like just spring it right together. So I'm going to try to get this. That was too far away. start in the greater hole and try to slide it forward. But sometimes the feed is in the way and the speed is really tight. So I'm gonna have to try from the tip. Yeah, this is so tight. This one of the ones where the feed and nib are screwed in. Okay, I'm take out the feed and nib. <gasps> oh my god, can I? Can I? Are you serious? Yes, 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 yes. Does the nib come off? job a whole lot easier if I could have taken the nib off. <sighs> Everything's still lined up good. Sometimes, if you press, you can flex it just a little bit because it is stainless steel and it does flex. You just gotta be careful if you're not gonna uh, put too much pressure on your tipping material. was able to separate them just a little bit more with my thumb a lot though. Let's see if I can slide this piece of glass again. Start with the breather hole. Yes, 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 yes. Come on, come on, come on, come on. 
gosh, it's so tight. I like can't get this in. Oh wow. Okay, it slipped out. Tuning in if it's hard. Props to all of the Nim Meisters out there. We're just gonna put a gentle flex in here. I say gentle and yet I'm bending steel. <laughs> but like do you see hold on, can you see the can you see? Watch the little dark line appear across the tip. When I press down. It's very, very faint on camera. But that's that's the split between the time it's separating across the midget when I press down on it. But I can't sit here holding it pressed down for two hours. I need to slip it fast. Yeah, let's go grab food. I'm not here to keep you from eating. Far be it from you because they think you don't eat. one's really hard. The gin hell that I did was not this stiff. Wow. No wonder it didn't want to write. It's so tight. I'm actually going to just sit here and I'm just going to press my finger in the middle of the nib so that I'm not putting as much pressure on the feed. I'm going to just hold this press into the desk mat so that it widens. Any visible difference. This is a really good nib. It just really needs to be lighter so that it actually flows good. This is a high quality, very springy nib. Fantastic quality. 10 out of 10 would purchase again. Then again, I believe it's a Schmidt. Because oftentimes these kits have Schmidt nibs, which are a German. German made nibs are really, really good. Uh, German is where the llamas are from, and the llamas are such good pants. I want to get a llama 2000, which I believe is one of the gold nib pants. Looks so nice. It's kind of in there. It's 
near enough to like hold it with. So it's completely in between the two tongues. Let's try again. I do not remember this being this hard last time. Which I think just goes to show how bad this thing feeds it. Yes, the string when we get to watch Valora fail even more than she does at video games. I bent my plastic trying to slide it in between. so much easier if this was not on the feed. I am now attempting to scissor the tines to slide this in between the tines. Put the tines scissored so that there's one right away. Oh, 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 oh. Just leave this shoved in here for a while. Make sure the two tines are back straight, even one with the other. This is going to be the hard part. I'm going to look straight down the barrel. I think one side will be a little bit more interesting. Press this side down because if your tines are like, let's see if we figure out work. Okay, so. So it's like little tines. If one of them is lower than the other, then it's going to give you a rough, scratchy surface. Because then this one is going, this one is going to catch on the paper while this one is smoothed down, and then this one's not even going to touch the paper if you're right into where this one is smooth. That's actually the issue that I have with this. Um, I think this was a Coleco, which is a German one, but that's what's wrong with this nib and why it's so scratchy, and I don't use this one right now is because the tines are misaligned. So I'm just going to push. Hold my nails so I don't pop my nail off. Push that one down. Just a little. Maybe I'm not going to get even. Yeah, I am 
successfully gotten a piece of plastic in between. I had to, um, so if you imagine for a moment that, um, my fingers are, my hands are the tines, and I will show you what I ended up having to do. I'll put the pin there so it's balanced. Okay, so, um, these are the tines, so I had to take the tines and spread them so that I could slip the piece of plastic through here at an angle. And then I had to realign the tines. Because if you leave them to where they're misaligned like that, then this one, the one that's lower, will drag along the paper when you're writing with the upper tine. And then if you're writing to where the lower tine is smooth, then your upper tine won't be touching the paper. And you'll get a very wonky, inconsistent, if they're at all, uh, line. Which is actually what's wrong with this pen. And why I don't use this pen. So let's see if we can fix this one too, shall we? We're already here, we might as well. Oh, this I think one of those ones is so slight that you can't even see it. Oh, but you can feel the writing. This right one is lower. I think if I just do that. Okay, and if you do it that way, you can see it just barely. It's the smallest little smidgen, but when you're working with something so tiny, just that smallest little smidgen can make a world of difference in how it feels. So I'm actually going to hold this one. I'm just going to hold this one slightly askew. So hopefully when it springs back, it'll be even. Alright, let's get a piece of paper. You are awesome. There's still a little bit of catch and drag, so we're just gonna display it. Display it. Display it. And try to even it out so that neither one of them is catching the other. There we go, that feels a lot smoother than it did the last time I used it. That is insane how such a small little thing can make such a big difference. Yes, oh, that feels so much better. So maybe we'll ink up this one to see and test this one out to see if it's working better. The smoothest pen I have, I will say, is probably my Twisby Broad Eco, or my Broad Nib Twisby Eco. Um, oh, so nice. This one honestly takes a close second. This is the Pilot Metropolitan. This is just a pull cap. The only issue I have with this, though, is that it dries out really fast. I want to try putting, like, maybe a little rubber O-ring in. See if that'll like stop it from drying out as fast. But it's so nice. So I might put like an everyday ink. Like an ink that I'll just use for like lit everyday to-do lists, like my bullet journal every day. Not my bullet journal, my prayer journal, um, and stuff like that. But it is so nice. Um, this one's also really good. This one is a resin pen actually a gin how but like looking at it you would think this is a super expensive pen but it's like less than 20 bucks look at this look at this dual tone nib look at this dual tone nib it's that yellow and silver tone on it it's so gorgeous Ooh, let me show you my latest acquisition
actually this one is tight. No, that one's not my latest acquisition. Oh, here's those Twizzies I was talking about that I love so much because they're so smooth. But you see the glitter here where the glitter settled out of this one. Um, we'll use that in a minute. This is my latest pink fountain. This is like my latest fountain pen acquisition. And it's also my largest fountain pen. But this white glows in the dark. It has blue and green sparkles. And it is number 64 out of 500. This is a limited batch run from Goulet Pins with the Benue Company. Ooh, that was close. Um, what sucks is they literally just did a 25% off sale after I bought it. And I was like, are you serious? I should have waited a smidgen longer and I could have gotten it for 25% off. But that's okay. Gold Spot Pins has an exclusive with Manu. And Gold Spot Pins. Look at this. It's the size of my freaking nail. It's humongous. It's so pretty. Um, but it's a Sakura Blossom one, and it is oh so gorgeous. But the Sakura Blossom one has got um, it's I don't remember if it's a Euphoria or a Talisman. Um, but the Cherry Blossom one is pink and blue. This one smells like lavender, by the way, because it actually has lavender in the um, resin. So this one smells like lavender on the inside. Um, but the cherry blossom one has cherry blossom-shaped holographic glitter throughout. Let me let me pull up a picture of my phone so you guys can see this. I think I still have it open from where I want to buy it for this next picture. Because it's just so pretty. It's just so pretty. Let me just open it. No. Oh, look, it's already pulled up. Let me close out my notification. Okay, nobody text me. That way nobody gets doxxed. But, like, look at it. Just look at it. It is insanely beautiful. So darn pretty. It's a talisman edition. But like, I want it so bad. And like, some of them have more blue, some of them have more pink. Because it's a hand mixed and poured resin fountain pen. So like, it's just, ugh. Just, ugh. Totally gonna be my next fountain pen. Like, and it's only a hundred and fifty-four dollars. Like, what? But yes, I love it so darn much. I would show you my other Banu, but currently Ajax has that one, so I can't show you my other one. But it's one of their Brie Lap line, and it's like, their ship, and it's like mini. It's like, that one is so freaking cute. Um, for those of you who can see it, it's like five, maybe six inches long. Um, very, very small. And it's like a magenta to blue with holographic glitter in it. And the blue glows in the dark. And then we have this. Which brings us to the next activity of the night. Which is, in fact, to chill and crochet. Do I want to ink these up? Do we want to watch me make a mess inking these up? Because I normally make a mess when I'm inking. 
Let's make a nice little ink. The question is... Dun. because this is like it's called a spring pin but it's got like a weird filling mechanism here I'll show you um, the filling mechanism on this one you press down on a spring and then you put it in the ink and then you let go and it draws up the ink into it it's actually really cool really easy and great for beginners um but it's not easy to fill out of like a sample vial. Which means I also can't put in one of these. This is gonna be hard to get out. Um, and this pin might actually go to Ajax and become Ajax's if she likes the way it writes. I'm thinking we might just do Mueller's Heart of Darkness, which is like a pure black ink. This is very dark. And, or we could get Ajax Star Ruby. Oh, you can't read the whole glass. Glass, 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 glass. Ah, star Ruby. Oh, that's upside down. Hold on. Da -da 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 I will get my stuff together. Star Ruby. Da -da -da -da. We could continue with the bright green and we could go North African Violet and actually give Ajax a dark, really pretty purple ink. Let's do that. Let's give Ajax a purple ink in the pin that may potentially be hers. Maybe it's just fake. Maybe it's telling me you don't need to do a full thing of purple. You like to change your ink colors too often. Although I know that some people actually will take theirs, flip it upside down, dump the ink down, and then like press out the air with the air pointing upwards. Like point up and press it down. And then flip it over and put it back in the ink bottle. I have seen people do that. Which I mean, if you're one of those people that's going to be writing a lot with your fountain pen, go for it. Fill that sucker up as much as you can. But I don't do a too terrible ton of writing, which I probably should fix because I love to write. Tunnel does not like me writing by hand. But I like to write by hand. And we now have one beautifully inked. Okay, so the last ink that I had in this pen made it write and made it feel very scratchy and dry. So I'm hoping that a different ink will have a different writing experience, which is pretty true. Oh, yeah, that feels much, much better. It doesn't feel like I'm like dragging a dry nib across paper there is now actually like it feels like there's ink in between me and the page which is what it should feel like and now we have a gorgeous gorgeous 
purple ink. Any gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous green. So this is like the foliage, and that's like the blossoms. So your thoughts are blooming on the page. That's kind of the theme I was going for. This watermelon one actually has, I think, diamond ox blood or writer's blood one. Let's see if it still writes. No, it is either empty or dried out. Or maybe it's just because it's been sitting nib up for so long. Let's see if I can get out. Ooh. Well, we got her going. A little too well. Take that with try not to flick ink everywhere. Valora. 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 That was not a smart decision. It's a good thing this is my um, ink and crafting desk mat. Which, I don't actually have a second de desk mat. That this is just the one that I have assigned to be that. I think this is writer's blood. I think this is just like red, uh, blue red enough to be writer's blood because diamond oxes ox blood and writer's blood are almost the same color, but not quite. And yes, it's just because of the sit down super, uh, tip up for some more. That is a very very fine nib and. Flint nibs aren't my favorite, so I don't tend to go for this one very often. Um, hazards of happening. I shall wear this as a badge of pride. Alright, so, so we get North African Violet in the green pen. I think we're going to do a dynamite thing. Because we have Aurora Borealis, Hope Pink, Oxblood, Pumpkin, which is a bright orange, Imperial Purple, Earl Grey, Writer's Blood, Steel Blue, and Delamere Green. Which I think Delamere Green is actually what I had in it previously. have Robert Foster Tranquility, which is a beautiful teal. But I think this might be what's in this one's, um, whatchamacallit, converter. So I kind of don't want to do that one. So, and I know Hope Pink, I think I have another one. So I think I might do Earl Grey, because I don't think I have a pin inked up with Earl Grey. Which is legitimately just a gorgeous gray color. So I'm leaning towards Earl Grey. Or there's a couple standard inks from the Infant Calendar. I don't want to put any glitter in it because I can't pull that one's nib and feet apart. So I can't easily flush it. I already have something inked up with this. Emerald Velvet Emerald is a standard from the Inkvent calendar. That one's already been used. That one's a chameleon ink. Chameleon ink just means it has a color shifting um color shifting pigment in it. Standard, here we go. Early dusk. So I wanna say this one's like a pretty like desaturated blue color. Um, ba ba what other standard inks do we have? That one's a chameleon. This one's like a gorgeous gold one. Uh, that one's star bright, which means it has an ultra amount of glitter in it. That one's a chameleon. This one is a moonbeam. It's a pretty baby with like a silver blue glitter in it. This 
this one is Fireside Snug, which is like a red orange kind of color. This is Tinsel, which I believe to be a red with gold shimmer. And on, let's get the pretty swirly action going. Ooh, health potion. Don't drink it. It doesn't do anything. I need to go in my bag, my box, and organize everything. It's a mess. Alright, Marion Bright, which is a gorgeous green with like a little pale bright green silver kind of shimmer color to it. This one is another standard. It's called Walnut. It's a really pretty dark brown. Legit looks like walnut shells. Here. Oh look, here's another piece of acetate. This one's another shimmer. This is lavender frost, which is really pretty purple with a gorgeous like silver shimmer to it. It's like a dark, a dark like gunmetal gray mixed with purple kind of shimmer color to it. Let's see if I can capture the shimmer on camera. No, you can't really see it through the bottle. You can't even really see it through the bottle in person either. Mm, that's a chameleon. It's Bah Humbug. It's a red with like a red gold shift shimmer in it. This one is also a shimmer. This one's Masquerade, which is like a pretty like lavender silver color with like a gold shimmer in it. This one is a standard. This is Weeping Willow. It's like a really pretty pale kind of golden rod color. That one might actually, I might use that one because I actually really like a pale color. This one's a shimmer. This one is Sugar Snap, which is an interesting name considering it's green. Like, when I think sugar snap, I think, like, pretty golden caramelized sugar. I don't think green. Nightfall is a chameleon ink. It looks like a blue-green shift shimmer in it. Uh, here's another standard. No, this is scented. Nope, standard. Okay. Cashmere Rose. Actually, Cashmere Rose might be a good one. So our top contenders currently are Weeping Willow and Cashmere Rose. Uh, here's the scented one. It's called Sweet Dreams. It's the bright pink, which is also a top contender for the pink pen. Uh, Rainbow's End, which I believe is a chameleon. I want to say it's like a purple kind of color with like a bright red pink shift shimmer in it. And I did just catch a nail. Please, Lord, don't let that pop off. Oh, that's Nightfall again. Last one, I think. Last one. Last one. This is another chameleon. This one's Tranquility, which is a pretty, like, purple with, like, a red gold shift to it. So, here we go. We've gone through everything. We have our top contenders. Chicken contenders. Mmm, chicken. Meow. Okay. So. Whoop. Did I catch it? No, I did not catch it. Um, I dropped it. I thought I caught it. It bounced. It's behind my wheel. It fell behind my wheel. By her sign snug. Please note these labels are not color accurate. But they do give you an idea of the kind of color it is. So here's our color option. 
I don't know. I kind of want to do the fireside snug, but just because it's winter and like it's a cozy color and we're doing chaos to cozies. I kind of want to do fireside snug just to keep with the theme that we've got going. Let's do it. Let's do fireside snug. Just randomly tosses all my other junk back in the box. one I actually need a syringe for because I think this one is a yeah this one is a cartridge that I have to refill it does not have a converter I have to refill a cartridge and grab a syringe when you have to say I'm not a junkie because I have a syringe To be fair though, my syringe is blunty when I do a junkie. Don't do drugs, kids. Just spend lots of money on really pretty fountain pens and ink that you know you're never going to use up, but it makes you happy to look at. You can also donate to charities, donate to your local church, help out in shelters, soup kitchens. You know, I put the cartridge back in the pan and I need the cartridge out to be able to fill the cartridge. Oops, I forgot to put these two up as well. <laughs> That's fine, I still have it pulled out beneath me. Let's put those up right quick, shall we? Oh my gosh, y'all. I still almost got too much ink. I'm trying to squeeze out that last little. <gasps> oh, I made it shoot back up. Oh my god. Too much, too much pressure, too much pressure. Can I pull the syringe up till it gets up and down it? bit off the syringe just blow back straight up out the hole <laughs> oh that was hilarious I now need to wash my hands because I am nasty the only bad part about using a cartridge and refilling a cartridge is that I now have to set it like tip downward nib downward to let it drain out by the way, in case you're curious, this is a holy gopher tail. I believe. I'm going to put that right there. And I'm going to cap this before I'm over. 
And now I'm gonna go wash my hands and rinse out my syringe. So let me put Oscar on his knee right. One thing I do not like to scrub on, and that is toilet paper. And I was not the last person to like toilet paper for her, but my house, and they kind of scraped on me. And yeah, it's not fun. This is not fun. <sighs> yeah, they cannot wash off my way. They're still, still orange from fire sign. Was it up? Was it nib down long enough to have a have flow yet? No. We're gonna give it a little bit of help. So fuzz. Yep. I don't think I just need to be in Oh yeah, that writes so much better than the last time I used it. It's still a little squeaky scratchy going that direction. 
So we need that tiny little upper level. So let's hold it at an angle like that. Oh yeah, there we go. That's writing pretty darn good. It still has more feedback than I prefer for a fountain pen. Because I really like a nice, juicy, smooth. Which is why I want to get some more pelicans and pilots. Oh, that's too close. But you can see the color get up close. Nice, gorgeous, 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 like mid tone fire kind of red color. I'm kind of scared to pull the acetate out yet. It's like, what happens if I pull it out and then it's not done spreading yet? I'm going to pull it out too early. We're going to put another piece of acetate in there since it was so dry. I'll just like get it extra good. This is so, it's so like really narrow, really tight. Everybody's eight. And can I need to move on to the next portion of today's show, which is crocheting with me while I am way too awake. I am starting to get a little sleepy though, which is good. I went too long in between chip breaks and I forgot how spicy my chips were. I wish I could make my chat look like a little cell phone screen where it looked like a, um, a little group chat on the screen. That would be so cute. Okay, so I'm put I'm placing my bet now. I think that this right thumb is gonna pop off first. Or this right pinky. Thumb and pinky on the right hand. That's what I think are gonna pop off first. Can you see okay? Yeah, okay, I got you pretty much. Centered. This is not my preferred um, placement of my hands for crocheting. But I'm trying to get you guys a halfway decent view. I really agree that that would be cute, Kyrie. Gosh, 
I am like so hyper aware that I really need to be going to bed right now. But like, I don't want to go to bed because tomorrow's gonna suck. Because I got like majorly adult. So I have to take the pack older elder to her social thing at like nine. 15 is when we need to leave. And then I gotta sit there through old people that are half tone deaf singing. And, oh man. It's Jesus time. It's Jesus time. It's Jesus time. Oh, and then I gotta like sit with her while she eats and try to eat quickly and try to convince her to eat quickly and try to keep her from talking the entire time she's trying to eat and choking. That woman will eat the entire time while she's talking. And she wonders why she gets strangled. Like maybe because you're talking while you're supposed to be eating. Talk with your mouth full all the time. Step it. But everybody else is also carrying on conversations around her, and she has um, cocktail party syndrome. So it makes her hard for her to hear and understand other people in that kind of environment. So it's kind of nice, because that means she talks a little bit less, because she's not carrying on a conversation, because she can barely hear people. So maybe it won't be too bad. But like, it starts at 10. And then it goes for however long the singing is going to go, which is sometimes short, sometimes long, based on the past few months' experience with this event. And then food and having to go through the line. But I was thinking about maybe going out early and seeing if I can get the ladies there to let me get our plates before everybody else because I have a doctor's appointment that we have to like turn around and we have to leave no later than 1230 because it's gonna take a half hour to get back here from there. So that'll put me getting back, if I leave at 1230, it'll take, ugh, it'll be one o'clock getting back here. And I have to turn around and leave because it's like a 20 minute drive to the clinic that I have to be at. So we have to leave no later than 12.30. And I'm just like, uh, I don't wanna. But like, Celeste can't drive her. Alan can't drive her. Neither, neither her daughter nor her son-in-law can drive her because they both work. So neither of them can take her. So I'm literally her only option. It won't be a struggle because if I have to, I can literally throw her over my shoulder like a sack of potatoes and drag her out of there. And she already knows I have an appointment, and I already told her that we have to leave at 12. So, hopefully it won't be an issue. Fingers crossed it won't be an issue. I just realized I got, I, lean, I started leaning back and got my hands closer to me. And you guys can't see what I was doing. <laughs> hand cam without the hands.
also have to stop by the vet on the way back from my doctor's appointment because I have to make doctor's appointments for the dogs. So I can do those in person on the way back. Because I don't know why, I don't care that it's a receptionist that's going to be answering the phone and that it's literally their job. I hate calling businesses to make appointments. I hate it. I don't know why. By the way, I lost my green stitch marker. I have no idea where it is. I had it on the stacks and it disappeared. So um, I'm using a pink one. To keep it from disappearing, let me just clip it on the bottom. That's smart. Let's be intelligent. Let's use that single brain cell. gonna finish out this row and maybe do one or two more and then we'll call it a night because I just hit me very very hard wave of tired like it kind of just went near seven thirty eight so you can start waking up ooh that's not fun that is not fun for a man with insomnia I think I have my alarm set for seven. Um, yeah, we're gonna see how well that goes to get up that early. I actually should probably be signing off so that I can go to bed right now. So let's just finish off this row and pull the acetate out of that fountain pen, re-ink it back up with its converter and see if it's got better flow, shall we? Alright. Crochet hook out. Stitch marker in. It is now hooked and Save. Now we can just flip that back around and resheath the crochet hook. And leave all the loose yarn. By the way, this is like half of a dishcloth. Once it's finished, it'll probably be about. Mm, I don't know, I'll probably give her a good size dishcloth. Probably about like that if there's enough yarn for it. Cloth. Nice big dishcloth, very jacks. We're gonna set that to the side. We're gonna eat some more spicy chips. I need to finish off my chips because I have two open bags of chips. I got distracted and didn't have to eat them. can see the slit a little bit better. A little bit better. Alright, let's get this ink in. AC 
cleaned it with some skull washi tape so that it wouldn't leak. <laughs> I just flung ink when I got that sticky off. Whoops. At least it didn't fling onto the pale blue shirt. No, I just had freaking. <laughs> I must ask you a question. Um, that guy looks like a mustache. Alright, that is it. I forgot how tight this converter fits in here. Whoops, I unscrewed the stuff. If it's in so tight, you can unscrew. <laughs> you can unscrew the nib and feed if you're not careful. Let's put this down. Yes, brush, page. Twist the ink down. Force the ink through the nib. I'm starting to see some ink on the nib, so suck it back up. Screw the body of the pin back on and say screw you. And try writing with me now. Hopefully. I think that actually might have done it! Oh my god! I think that did it. Let's see. Let's see. What happened? There's some skipping if I write super fast, but it looks like the acetate trick worked. It looks like we have successfully widened it just enough to let out some more ink when it writes so that it's not super skippy while just straight up writing at a nice pace. So, success on two different pins. And now that all but one of my pins are back together. Boop, 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 boop. I love the glitter on the top of these. Got icing on the cake. So I'm gonna stop. And I'm gonna say thank you so much for hanging out with me while I do all of this. Thank you for coming stream. I hope you guys were able to chill out and have some relaxation time with me as I did my stuff. I hope you guys had fun, fun, fun. And that you guys will join me back here next time. Hopefully we will be back again next Monday. Uh, hopefully earlier in the day. Today was a little weird because my Wi-Fi was out. So I had to, uh, get that piece, but, you know. So I will see all you lovely kittens next time.